Oh, hello again. My name's Dylan. I've been reading this book called Zog. It's all about this dragon that goes to dragon school and learns dragon things. It's really good. Now, I actually have a dragon here to show you. Unfortunately, he's not been to dragon school yet, so he can't fly or breathe fire. This is Sparky. Now, Sparky here is a bearded dragon from Australia. Now, they're called a bearded dragon because they've got this big spiky throat that they can puff out to make it look like they've got a big massive beard. And they do that to scare off anything that might want to try and eat them. Imagine that. And they're a type of reptile called a lizard. Now, all reptiles, they're covered in scales that run down their body. And those scales help protect the lizards. It's like a bit of a suit of armour for them. And they also, they get their energy from the sun. So on a sunny day, Sparky sunbathes all day and then goes out in the evening for something to eat. And his favourite food, like a lot of lizards, their favourite food are insects. So all types of bugs and creepy crawlies like crickets, spiders, and he chases them down and gobbles them up. Om, nom, 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 like that. And he's also got these sharp claws. Can you see those sharp claws? Because he uses them to climb trees with, looking for bugs. And did you know he can actually change colour? So on a sunny day, he goes really yellow. On a cold day, he goes dark brown. And if he's really angry, his beard turns black. We're okay at the moment though, he's quite chilled out, don't worry. And do you see those holes at the side of his head? Do you see those? They're his ears. Yeah, we've got flappy ears, like dogs and cats. Lizards have just got holes in the side of their head. And like a lot of lizards, they've got this big, long tail. And a lot of lizards, they use that tail to balance themselves with when they're climbing trees uh, and things. Uh, but a lot of lizards' tails can actually come off. Yeah, so if something's chasing it that wants to eat it, their tails can come off. They wriggle on the floor on their own like this. The thing that wants to eat them grabs the tail while the lizard runs off and escapes. And then they can grow a new one back like... Like that. It doesn't make that noise. It's not as quick as that. Yeah. Right, so that was Sparky, the bearded dragon. I'm going to put Sparky back so he can get ready for, for his first year at uh, dragon school. There we go. Bye, Sparky. And I'm going to finish this book. So I hope you enjoyed that, everyone. Take care. Bye.